I'm gonna go on udemy.com and try to learn how to make content. But even if I, you know, try to start a cooking channel, I'm gonna have to see what I can do. You know what I'm saying? Because a cooking channel would probably work for me right now, whatever, you know. I don't know. I'll see what I can do. But would your ex give you money? Would your ex give you money? You know, I'm, I'm watching this man talk on his on the video, and I think he's he's saying that he's he has doubts. He was implying. I didn't watch the whole thing. He was implying he had doubts about it. He said, I, have, I know I have problems. I need to do it. But I pray about my problems. That's, my, that's what I think the answer is for me. That's what I think the answer is for me. You know what I'm saying? But, um, he, uh, he, he's saying, he, but, but maybe it's some gay people that is helping him. You know what I'm saying? Give him a, a high meal somewhere he can chill at. You know what I'm saying? Well, what what made it get to that point? Who knows? I mean, at 33, who knows what he did to tick his dad off? You know what I'm saying? His dad is fed up. He fed up. Because he would, I don't think he would have his business in the street like that. He wouldn't let, he would go ahead and give him some money so they can have some food and they can have some sustenance. You know, but you got to be wise. You know what I'm saying? You got to be wise. If, if your dad bought you a $50,000 condo, don't go and borrow against it. You can't pay it back and if people come and get it. You know what I'm saying? If, if, if you know, he give you a, a grocery card from the public for, I don't know, for $2,000, don't go and cash it in. You know, there's a place that will cash your gift card in for you. Don't go cash it in. And then you're hungry. You know what I'm saying? You got to be wise, you know. And I would want to offer some advice, but, but I would just go to anybody, not just this family. Get you some passive income. You know, go and get you a little franchise. You know, a little salmon shop or something. Go and get you a little, you know, a little chicken shop or something. And they could call you with the report every morning you made some money or not. You know what I'm saying? Go and get you a little vending machine. I, mean, I stay at the vending machine. Give me a root beer and a Pepsi. Go and get you a little vending machine. And make it some, uh, you know, get you about, get you about 10 vending machines. Have you some passive income. So, so all your dreams ain't coming true. So you ain't hitting the charts. The charts. And we ain't either. We ain't in the choice either. We ain't in the choice either. You know what I'm saying? You need to perfect your craft. You probably need a coach. You need a coach to perfect your craft. But if you can't afford a grocery, you can't afford a coach. So I think I would I would say, can you can you go to your ex and ask for something? I can. So I think that that it was okay. Go ahead, go ahead and give them some money. Go ahead and get some money. I had a business in the street like that. You know, give him a few dollars. I ain't saying go and give him a million dollars and he's going to screw it up. You know he's going to screw it up. I mean, you know they got that thing where they smoking weed now. Everybody smoking weed. I'm watching these two white blonde women smoking weed. Somebody they smoke a little weed every now and then. You know what I do when I get sleep? She can't sleep. You know what I do when I can't sleep? I go jogging. Shoot. A four-mile jog every day will knock you. You knock me out. It knocked me right out. A full my joy if they knocked me right out. <clears throat> Thank you, my mission, nice man. Nice man, man, this man work at the hospital, make four thousand dollars a month. Yeah, nice looking man, nice looking Christian man. And uh, out there jogging. And then you can sleep good. I I, 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 I get in the bed and go right out. Soon I, soon I get in the bed at night. I mean, she's smoking a little weed because she can't sleep. That's another but the enemy. Ain't nothing but the enemy. He don't want to get that ball of money up in Los and know what he's doing with that money. But you got to have wisdom because you're going to make yourself look bad. Because people going to say your dad is fair. You're 33. Your dad is sick of that bull. 
but he don't want his business to street. He don't want you to be hungry. He don't want you to be hungry and go in the house with a bunch of men doing God knows what because they'll feed you. He don't want that. Get some sin. Sit out somewhere and listen to people and get some wisdom. Now, I had said you need to pray. I need to pray. I'm not going to comment on this more because I got my own problems. I have my own problem. I don't want to. I don't want to think people want to take my advice, but but go ahead and give them a few dollars so they don't be have their business all up in the street and have some wisdom with the little money if he gets try to give you something. Have some wisdom with it. Have a little wisdom with it. Have a little. We don't go out. Don't go out showboat. Yeah, you know, big and you're hungry and you're struggling and you're having a hard time. Don't go and get a Benz. Try to know this dude went got a a Lexus. Ain't put no insurance on him. The rest of the lessons doesn't have no car no more and no, no insurance for to get another one. And the money he spent, it was gone. 75000 you know. Don't do that. Don't, don't do that. It's show me in trying to show both. Go ahead and get you a nice little condo somewhere. If your daddy gets some money, get you some money. Put it, go get your little vending machine and get your little money out your vending machine every week. Uh, you know, and every, uh, how they do that? I don't know how they do that. You know, go get your little franchise. Go to franchise.com and see what they got that you might like to be interested in. Me personally, I don't want to get that. I want to have to watch over. You want some passive income? Well, they gonna call you every morning and say, "Look, this is the report and this is how much you made." We sold. Fifty thousand chicken sandwiches. And you know niggas need to be shaming they stuff in the stove fighting over chicken sandwich. And then get mad when the wife was sitting in his nest. <laughs> Can't have a watermelon and chicken round a nigga. Then they get mad. But they in the restaurant fighting over chicken sandwich. They make a pretty money over them chicken sandwiches, baby. But I ain't gonna lie to you, they're good. Them chicken sandwiches is good. I wanna give me one, but I ain't wanna get in the fight. But anyway. Go and get your little franchise. You know, get your little franchise and let, and let the manager call your money and say they done made some money for you. And and then, you know, you want to be an entertainer, go ahead and get your little crap. Go and perfect your little crap with the coach and get you some money. Don't be embarrassing your daddy. I'll be in the street. I'm going to tell you what you look like. You look like he's sick of you. You know what you look like. You grown, and people going to tell him that's a grown man. And you out there hungry. The daddy don't let you be hungry. My ex, my ex ain't gonna leave my, my dad is dead, but my dad ain't give a damn when he was alive. My ex is, uh, ain't gonna let me, you know, I could go to my ex right now. Your mama, he, your dad might give your mama something. He might, he might care enough about your mama, go ahead and give y'all some money. Quit, quit out there acting a fool. Get some wisdom. Be quiet. The Bible says a fool look wise when he close his mouth. Be quiet. And just listen to people and get some wisdom and learn something. Now, if you get some money, go out there and get no weed and no, and no car you ain't got no insurance on. Go and get some money to live and get some food and perfect your crap. You know, but I don't want to recommend to nobody to work with. You might have to go out and get your, get your little crew, get your only crew and meet some people and see who won't work with you. And I don't want to recommend to nobody to for the work with you. I'm sorry, baby. Nobody want to recommend to nobody. You just clowns. You look, you just really look a clown. And then you say, well, the, the, the daddy hurt you. I'm so sorry. That's some, that's, it's people kill their family for hurting them like that. I'm so sorry your daddy hurt you. But, but people ain't gonna believe you. People ain't gonna believe you the way you act. You, you, you don't, people ain't gonna believe that. People don't, believe, people don't think you want some money and he mad and you, he don't want to hear that boo. He's sick of you coming around trying to get a free ride and all of that. He got some money. Yeah, he got it. <laughs> he got it. You ain't got, you got to be hungry. He got it. You got it. You got to, you got to be quiet and close your mouth and get some wisdom. Be, be quiet and close your mouth and get some wisdom. And, get, and he gives some money on way. So go and get you some passive income from someone. Go go to the bank. I ain't saying the bank know what they're doing. But go to the bank and tell them, tell them you need some advice on how to get some passive income. They might charge you a consultation fee. And they might not know. But my recommendation for a passive income right now is this is a little franchise of some kind. It's a passive income, you and your mom. But he got it. He got it. Go ahead and get y'all some money. Be quiet with all that mess if you're not going to go to the authorities and press form a charge. I'm looking at the man on TV right now. I'm not going to comment on that till after it's over. 
I come, people want to say, oh, is it telling me how to get out of there? Baby, he's sitting and telling when he on easy street. And that's all I'm going to say. For what he did, he on easy street. And that's all I'm going to say. Now, goodbye.